One of you have to live in California does not make the process harder when you live apart, whether you're in another state or country or county or in jail. Talked about that the other day. So uh, I had a call. I get calls all the time where one spouse is in California, one spouse is in another state. That does not make my process any more difficult because everything I do is remote for the most part. If you are in a county that allows for e-file and electronic signatures, everything is obviously e-signed and e-filed, which makes it nice. Um, also, even if you're in another county that does not have uh, e-file or um, e-signature applications, or they don't allow for that, um, or even if you know when they're in another state, uh, I use a portal called My Case, and it it's a system. It's I don't use email. I don't feel like that's secure. We have a lot of documents going back and forth with private information, account information, pensions, bank account uh, numbers and information, stuff like that. I do use a secure portal for that purpose, and it, it, it for that for two reasons. One, it's secure, and all your information will be safe. It's only between me and you. It doesn't go through the interwebs and where people can snatch it. It's just a secure communication between me and you and your spouse. And then as well as the document uploads are not submitted uh, via the internet. They are just uploaded to a portal that is a drive, a private drive that I have. Um, so it, it's not something that gets transmitted per se. Um, the other reason is that it keeps everyone on the same page with this portal, meaning we don't have to for, remember to reply all or whatnot. I start with every new case. I start an email thread, uh, not an email thread. Now I'm confusing you. I start a message thread through the portal that uh, goes to both parties. And so anytime anyone communicates, I communicate, there's a, a one of the spouses communicates, it goes to the three of us and we're all on the same page throughout the process. That obviously makes people feel more comfortable working with us because I do work as a neutral third party for, for both spouses in every case. And so people want to make sure that there's not any individual one-on-one -on -one conversations going on behind the scenes. And this is one of those ways I make, I ensure that that happens. Also, with the portal, documents can be electronically signed. When I upload documents for review, you get an email notification that, that to log in and uh, take a look at what the document is. And if you have questions and so forth, you can comment and uh, make notes and all kinds of good stuff. So that's how we um, keep everyone on the same page. But to answer the question, living out of county, because of the way we handle the process and the systems we have in place, uh, or out of country even, does not make the process of divorce any more difficult. The um, What I tell folks all the time on the phone is the only thing that can be complicated in your divorce is you or your spouse. My service is the same as long as you're amicable, cooperative, and both parties will sign off on everything. I don't care. I've had, I've had cases with six kids, 10 homes, 14 vacation properties, uh, raw land, um, all kinds of complex uh, agreements and terms they wanted to put into their divorce. That's not the complication. The complication comes where if parties don't agree for some reason at some point and we can't finalize your divorce, that's where we run into issues. Usually that doesn't happen because I do a very good job on my consultations, talking to folks to get a feel. Not only are you asking your questions and I'm answering them as far as what I can do and, and how your divorce process will go, but I also want to get a feel for how amicable you and your spouse are and if you'll be a good fit for me in as far as what I do doing amicable divorce cases in California.